Yeah. 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 Me? Yeah, because my hand bong You think you're a young man? My hand bong eh? You think you're a young man? Hold up, oh. You think you're a young man? Then they gear the boy! <laughs> Fasten your seat belts and prepare for an awesome experience. Showcasing the best of Jamaica's automotive culture. Eight seven six streets, repping for Jamaican sickest rides. Thank goodness for all the Hollywood fans out there and for all the Gore fans too. With Tommy and my father, uh, you know, the next time that we're going to go out there and race, the the, the three generations of Gore are going to be a really <laughs> a serious contenders in all in all fields and telling it's going to be awesome, awesome. <laughs> two runs because the cars came a little late because they were at the dyno and we were just getting everything finalized for a little shakedown today for both me and my grandpa. The first run went really well, did a long run, everything felt great. I got back into the groove, liquor rusty, I haven't tested since last year November but everything is good, we're hoping to get something going and we're ready for everyone in MP2 when it happens. The upgrades that we've done really nothing much since we've gotten the car from the Moody's from NG Racing. We sent it back to them and we got it fine tuned, everything ran through, like a corner balancing here and just making sure everything is perfect for me when we went touch the track again. Neil Gore, grandfather of Tommy Gore. It was really fun. I mean, I haven't raced anyone since 2019 in October, but we were really, we were just having fun out there. I was driving behind him, looking at his lines. He went in front for a little. You'll soon be up there touching up some of the young guns. some BC racing coilovers and the same B18C engine but what's in there I can't tell you, you just have to quiet it down for now. After, after I win a few championships I release the specs. We have to keep it on the wraps for now and you'll know after I win a couple titles for sure. 75, April 7th, 1946. Father of Doug Hollywood, grandfather of Tommy War. Thanks to Doug, it's a Father's Day gift that he has set me up with a car to race again. Hoping to entertain our fans.
as gentlemen on the track and hopefully all three of us be on the podium. Enjoy yourselves. <laughs> well, that, that, that was the greatest part of the game. But anybody could ever have. Thank you so much. Yeah, man, it was awesome seeing you out here. Yeah, man. Just in a corner. Okay, I was, I was trying to turn off. Huh? I tried to turn off, Daddy. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I'm turning off. Oh, I'm turning off. You soon get used to it. I don't turn off your fan, man. Steering on. Okay, oh, it's close. Okay, I think they're in the wrong place. <laughs> It's nice to hand some phone and turn off the fan. What is that? Text on my phone that Matthew said I'll soon be back. Join you guys. He he wants to come back as well. How does it feel to be, you know, in such an iPod machine out there today? Just like when I was a young man. <laughs> Just like a thrilling experience that until you do it. You will never know. Age is only a number. It's your health, how you feel, and guidance from family and friends that will make you do things like this. When we started coming out here and practicing, my Instagram page lit up like a Christmas tree. <laughs> and of course, you're partly it, of course, they help with that. Uh, you know, the amount of followers that I even got have been amazing. Everybody just wants to hear and see what's going on with our camp. Uh, you know, it's funny with racing here in Jamaica. Yeah. You, you either hate Doug Gore or you love him. It's either or. For one thing's for sure, they just want to see me out there. And whether it's for, for me to go and get my ass cut or I'm going to cut theirs. <laughs> don't matter, they, they just want to see what's going on. So actually that's all part of the fun. I don't mind being the evil guy. I'm here to cut a few throat and come and show them say, the beast is here to stay, you know? So the guys from OMSC came down they really did a fantastic job with the car. Once he was happy with the car, then you know, I came in and jumped in. After driving the car now for literally three days straight. And absolutely nothing was wrong with the car. I mean, no leaks, no, no engine problems, no gearbox issues. We were very, very happy with the way the car ran. Just some teething pains now that we're going to go through with just the setup of suspension, which is important. Uh, we, we see on the data logger that if we put all the, the good parts of the track together, we actually see a very, very, very good time. So that's exactly what we need to do, is to go out there now and actually do the one great lap, you know? But the, the lap times here is not the biggest issue. Uh, we see that the car is extremely fast. Especially down the straightaway, we're over 200 kilometers an hour on the straightaway. I don't think there's any car in Jamaica that is here that can see us at the end of the straightaway. Actually right now I think even just changing the, the, the way the car is going to be driving as far as the gearbox is concerned that this car is going to be extremely fast at Jamwes. So we see serious, serious progress. So we're looking forward to many, many good things to come with this car. And I'm really glad that 876 Streets was here to, to document a lot of what was going on. So keep in touch. There's plenty more to come.
to say a huge big up and a huge thank you to all my sponsors who got the car out here today. Bull Wrecking, Rainforest, 24 Carat, Anzoel Lubricants, ATL Automotive, Boomerang Tires, Spanish Court Hotel, S Hotel in Mobe, Sherwin Williams, Miracle Corporation, as you know, is supporting Dover itself. Uh, donating $2 million and every little bit counts and once we get racing back going every every little minor donation or whatever it, it always helps and keeps racing going. Thank you for watching another video production of 876 Streets. Subscribing to our channel definitely means a lot to us. Thanks for your continuous support. Assassin, big up to the voters, big up to the bogus, big up to the dancers, big up to the sizzlers, most of all, free up the weed planters, cause we have a lot of weed exporters, and we party.